Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing an updated tutorial on how to install the Little Maid mob mod for Minecraft versions 1.6 onwards as well as version 1.5.2 using the new 1.6 launcher. So you're going to need a few files before we get started. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to do the install for 1.5.2 first because it is more complicated. But you're going to want to scroll down here. I'll put a link to this webpage in the description. You want to scroll down here and you'll look for the old files link right here at the bottom. You want to click that. It will take you to this page here. And you'll want to click this last box right here. And it will have a whole bunch of zip files in it. You want the one for 1.5.2. So you want to click that, download it, put it where you'll remember. And then you'll also want to scroll down and look for the MMM lib. You'll want the 1.5.2 the most recent you want to click that download it save it and then you'll want to head over to the minecraftforge.net and you'll want to download the latest version of forge for 1.5.2 you need to click this right here the universal installer and then you'll download that and whatever so now what we need to do is open up the minecraft launcher itself all right once that's done you need to create a new profile. I've already got one here, so I'll show you. Uh, you want to create a new profile, and then you'll want to select this Use Version Release 1.5.2. So select 1.5.2 from the dropdown and save the profile, and then uh, click Play once, let the game start, and then exit out. Okay, once that's done, you can go down to Percent App Data Percent to the dot minecraft folder and then you will find this right here versions now you'll see that you have a 1.5.2 folder ignore all these these are for me doing other stuff but this is the one we want to concern ourselves with today so take this 1.5.2 folder you want to copy it and you want to paste it and then you want to rename it to something you'll remember so I'm going to go with LMM because that was what I called my profile so You'll want to open this up and you'll find two files inside, a jar and a JSON. You want to rename both of these to the exact name you named the folder, so caps and everything. So LMM and LMM. All right, now once that's done, you want to go to the JSON file and you want to open it with a word program. So I'm going to open this with note and you will see right here it says ID 1.5.2. You want to select 1.5.2 and delete it. Now you want to rename the space right here. You'll name it what you named your folder. So LMM or whatever else you named it. And then save and exit. All right. Now you want to go to your jar and you want to open this with WinZip, WinRAR or 7-Zip, whatever you use. Okay. And then you want to delete the MetaInf folder. Yes. We do not want this folder. All right. Now leave this open and navigate to your install of Minecraft Forge Universal for 1.5.2. Open that and then we'll see here that there are a whole bunch of files inside. So you want to copy all of these using Control A and you want to drag and drop them into your Minecraft folder. Oh, whoops, that's wrong. Wrong folder. Here we go. Control A and then drag and drop to your renamed Minecraft jar. So LMM jar and this will transfer all the files from the forge install to the minecraft folder um, you will notice that there's a meta imp folder over here you do not want to delete this one this one needs to stay so if you've done everything correctly you'll find your new meta imp over here and then all the files will be there so you can exit out of that now open up your minecraft launcher again and let it do its thing and then go to your profile the profile you selected so right there and then you want to edit and then under use version you should see one called LMM or whatever else you named your folder so release whatever your folder name here if you find this you've done it correctly so do that and then save it okay you'll click play and a little box will come up right here it says FML is setting up your Minecraft environment. Okay, that's good. That means 
Forge for 1.5.2 has installed correctly. Alright, I've got a whole bunch of mods for 1.5.2 installed already, so I'm not going to show you my splash screen, so I'll be back in a second. Alright, once you have, um, once you've successfully launched your Minecraft and you've confirmed that Forge is working, go back to your, um, app data, percent, app data percent, and then the Minecraft folder, and right down here you'll see a mods folder. If you do not see the mods folder, create it, and it should be empty, but these are all my mods, so, uh, ignore these. And now you'll want to navigate to your where you downloaded your 1.5.2 versions of Little Maid Mob and the MMM Lib. So you want to click those and then you'll want to drag those to the mods folder. Once that's done, uh, you should be set for 1.5.2 version of the Little Maid Mob. Um, if you want the updated sounds so they don't sound like ghasts, you can head over to the Little Maid Mob uh, Minecraft forum thread scroll down and click the sound pack. I'll put a link to both this sound pack and this thread in the description. So it should take you to Mediafire. You can download that. And once that's done, it shouldn't matter if it's a different version than 1.5.2. You can, you go to your, back to your Minecraft folder, um, open up the sound file that you've just downloaded and you will see an assets folder. You want to take this assets folder and extract it directly into the Minecraft, the dot Minecraft folder itself. So here's mine right now. And if you don't have it, that's fine. Uh, it should be good to go after you do that. You should be able to load up your game and see that under the forge thing, if you click the mods thing on the 1.5.2 screen, uh, you should be able to find your little made mob thing in there. So once that's done, you're good to go. So now I'm going to move on to the 1.6.2 version. Um, what you need to do first is grab the 1.6.2 or later files from the official uh, download link of the mod creator uh, webpage or whatever. So scroll down until you find them here. So you want that, you want that. Uh, just make sure you get those two. And then you want to go over to the Minecraft Forge page again, which I put in the description, and you want to grab the latest version for whatever version you're using. Uh, I'm on 1.6.2, so I'm going to download the installer right here at the end. You do not want universal, you want installer. That is very important. So once you have that done, locate the installer, double click it, and you should come up with this. Now this screen either will give you an error or it will be like this and say you're good to go. Um, if you have an error, you need to either manually locate your .minecraft folder if you've installed it to another directory, or you need to run the game at least once so that it creates this .minecraft folder. Uh, click OK on Install Client, and then it should come up and say that you've downloaded the libraries and it's been successfully installed. I'm not going to do that because I already, already have it installed. So you can exit out of that and go back to your Minecraft launcher. Alright, once you're here, you should see something called Forge under the thing, if I, I've renamed it, but, uh, let's see, is it this one? It's one of these, it might actually be this one. No, it's not. It's LMM. Well, it'll say right here, it'll say release 1.6.2 or whatever version you're using, and then it will say Forge. And once that's done, you can rename it. So, and then it will say ready to play Minecraft, blah, blah, blah. And then click play and it will set up Forge. I'm not going to do it because I'm using 1.5. new mods right now. And it will give me an error at the splash screen saying that uh, my mods are out of date and it won't let me run the game. So it should just take you to the splash screen if you've done it correctly. So you can exit out of your launcher now, exit out of Minecraft, and go back to your percent app data percent folder dot minecraft and go to your mods and then go to the lmm forge or whatever wherever you downloaded your files to take the 1.6.2 version the 1.6.2 version again and drag and drop them into your mods folder if you do not have a mods folder create it it'll be fine 
and again to get the sounds so they don't sound like ghasts go to the little maid mob form post on the minecraft forms scroll down and click the sound pack once there you can download it and then open up the sound pack click this but click this right here the assets you want to drag this folder over to your dot minecraft directory so dot minecraft want to drag that and then drag it in here if you do not have it that's fine if you do have it it'll merge the folders that's fine too and you should be set to go